Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and here's another free macro from our friend Eskimo. He just uploaded, up, uploaded a couple of days ago. He's calling it Rect Area Dims, which I think stands for Rectangular Area Dimensions. It's pretty cool. If you look at this square, it is 2.3 or 2.039. If you wanted to label that, you could press create on his macro, what, and I am going to put a a uh, link to this to his blog where this is at. So he could do that. Here's another one. It's a little different. Create in in and I've just started playing with this. You can change the font size, decimal place, uh, font. So it's going center, and I'm going off of his video that he sent me, which you can watch from his blog. I just want it on my channel because I've got a few viewers and bottom outside, you know, so it's going to be a little bit offset from the square. But what it also could do, if you select all three of these and select treat selection as a single object, so these four triangles or there are three triangles are nine and a half by six point or eight point six seven, and we can prove that by selecting it, holding down the shift key, and creating a rectangle by double clicking our rectangle, or our rectangle is nine and a half by six, 8.67. That's pretty cool. I'm sure I'll probably do some more videos on it uh, when I uh, learn it a little bit. I just downloaded it. So look for the uh, link to his and what's so cool about this, you can move it around whatever you want it to. But if you just need this, you know, that's a 3.029 rectangle. 3.029. And let's let's back up here and let's make it let's make it six decimal places and see how far it goes. Look at that, it's 3.029492. If you had to be dead on. Pretty cool free mackerel from our friend. Hope that helped. Thank you. Watch. And